I was walking home one night in the Rocky Mountains of America. I'd been over there on a backpacking holiday, but now I was getting quite sick of it in the mountains of America. So I thought it might be reaching the time where I might have to jack in. I walked to the side of a nearby road I stuck up my thumb and I prayed that I would get a lift And I dropped my last tab of acid To set the edge off waiting for a lift And over the hill came a greyhound bus I stuck up my thumb and luckily it stopped to pick me up the bus was full of nuns They were on their way To a nuns convention They were all wearing their nun outfits There were thin nuns and fat nuns There were young nuns and old nuns There were nuns with moustaches There were nuns with glasses One of the nuns offered me a sandwich but it was egg So I said, no thanks love, you're alright I've had some acid, I don't fancy it It looks the wrong colour to me And it was all going well I sat on the bus I started to relax And to read my book that I took on holiday with me And the nuns were all happily praying and that And looking out of the windows was all going fine and I was just about to nod off to sleep when the driver died of a heart attack and the bus careened from side to side and the nuns were screaming the nuns were screaming the nuns were screaming I thought I must be dreaming oh the nuns were screaming the nuns were screaming the nuns were screaming it was fucking with my reading they went Particularly dangerous, I said. Don't worry, nuns, I've come, I'm here to save your lives. And that was when I pushed the dead body of the bus driver to one side. As I got into the driving seat, I thought, oh dear, what a shame he had to piss his pants when he died. But never mind, I've got nuns to save, I thought, as I grabbed the steering wheel. And I started to feel like I was on some kind of a mission to save the nuns And I looked out of the window of the bus and I thought How difficult could it be to drive a bus? I've seen it on TV, it doesn't look that dangerous Why are all these nuns causing such a fuss? And it was just about then that I remembered the tab of acid that I'd taken Just before I got on board the bus And as it kicked in, everything fucked up And I fucking lost control of the bus Then it fell down a ravine and the nuns were killed The nuns were killed, maimed and smashed The nuns were covered in broken glass The fucking nuns were dead some them had glass right through the head Some were maimed, some were destroyed Some were dropped into the void But not me I got away scot-free There wasn't so much as a paper cut on me I stepped out of the burning wreckage of the bus at the bottom of the ravine It was a fucking mess, there were dead nuns everywhere It was a sight the like of which I'd never seen 
the nuns were burning and I could see in the badly blackened burnt hand of a dead nun a badly blackened burnt egg sandwich and around about that time I was glad I hadn't had one because it made me feel a bit sick like looking at all them dead nuns at the bottom of that ravine I thought how come they all got killed and smashed and maimed and killed and smashed to smithereens and I didn't when they've been spending their lives praying to Jesus and God every day why has he decided to spare me? Why has he decided to take their lives away? And then I thought maybe it's cause of the St Christopher medal that my mum gave us when I was 21. Or the one that my nana gave us that used to belong to my granddad. I mean that might have protected me. Yeah that's probably it I thought. And the local sheriff turned up in his car and he said What the hell happened here son? I said I don't know, there's just loads of dead nuns I didn't really see, I was just walking past, I'm from Keithley, I didn't have all to do with it. I thought, fucking hell, it's, it's fucking dangerous in America, man. I'm going to have to continue my holiday somewhere else. I'm going to have to go somewhere that's not quite as, you know, dangerous and that. I continued my holiday in the Tibetan mountains of Nepal Next to those mountains I felt quite petite and the mountains looked very fucking tall I'd been walking for days in the hope of having a spliff with a yeti but when I finally met a yeti, he didn't like spliff, but he made nice spaghetti, so that was all right. But now I was getting tired of all the snow, and I thought I could do with a lift. A lift to take me somewhere where we can buy some more weed, would be nice. So I put on my distress flares, they are bright orange. I only wear them when I'm distressed And I prayed 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 for a lift All of a sudden I saw a helicopter And it led down a rope ladder and I climbed on board But the helicopter was full of nuns they were disabled nuns They were on their way To a di disabled nuns conference in Tibet Oh yeah There were thin nuns and fat nuns There were deaf ones and blind ones There were nuns without glasses There were nuns without moustaches of the nuns offered me a samosa but it was egg and I said you're all right love and so I ate my last piece of Nepalese temple ball hash I thought I'm gonna fucking just sleep this one out I think helicopter full of nuns on the way to a disabled nuns conference boring and I shut my eyes started to drift into sleep Then the pilot died of a heart attack And the helicopter started to go upside down And the nuns were screaming The nuns were screaming The nuns were screaming I thought I must be dreaming All the nuns were screaming The nuns were screaming The nuns were screaming It was driving me mental They went ah! To have one for me action men when I was little it was a whopper I got into the seats that the pilot had just vacated 
And I realised quite quickly that he'd also lost control of his bowels when he died. Oh, bugger. And I thought, I'll just have a look at the controls of this helicopter. It can't be that difficult to do. I'm sure it's easy enough. Fucking hell, if no Ledmans can fly, one any cunt can. And I looked at the controls of the chopper. And the nuns were all screaming. All the nuns were screaming. Once again, I felt like I must be dreaming. And I thought, oh, it can't be too hard to fly this, surely. And then the piece of Nepalese temple ball hash that I'd had to eat when I got on the chopper started to kick in. And I thought, fucking hell, you know what? I'm fucking starving. I'm really hungry. I could really do with something to eat. And I thought, I'll just go in back at Chopper and see if that nun's still got any of them eggs and mozzas left. God, I'll fucking munch it out. And then I'll come back and work out how to fly this Chopper. And the Chopper crashed down a ravine. All the nuns were smashed and killed to smithereens. The nuns were burned and horribly killed. The nuns were fucking destroyed by twisted bits of black and burning metal and generally killed. I even landed in a particularly soft Tibetan ganja tree And when I slid down the branches of the tree There was a load of scantily clad women waiting for me They just cooked me some really nice tea I said, how did you know that was going to happen? They said, we're psychic, you see I said, oh, nice of you to wait for me at the bottom of this tree And all around me bits of burning nun were falling from the sky Some of them had been roast and some had been fried But all the nuns had died Bits of burning nun, they fell from the sky And I just sat there getting high And I thought, them poor nuns They truly are the unfortunate ones How come I always escape? Must be because of my St. Christopher medal the patron saint of travellers Oh yeah He must have looked after me Thanks very much St Christopher I said As I lay down in a big fluffy bed With the scantily clad women in bikinis Who were gently rubbing my shoulders And I looked at the dead burning nuns And I thought you spent all your life praying to God And Jesus and that and going without stuff and wearing stupid clothes and now you're all dead you stupid nuns you unfortunate nuns you unlucky lucky nuns you unlucky nuns you unfortunate nuns oh yeah and in the twisted black and burnt forearm of a nun I could see a slightly singed egg and moles and I thought that'll do for me tea 